Today I'd like to talk to you a little bit about Goldilocks and about your inner Goldilocks. Um, Goldilocks was a story that I really related to when I was a kid. And um, I really loved the way that she knew what she wanted and she knew what didn't work for her. And I was pretty much, pretty much that way when I was a kid too. And I was called fussy and I was called picky and I was called thin skinned. And you know, I was everybody's, you know, I was a problem, right? Because I didn't want to be uncomfortable. And, um, <laughs> you know, that's, that's the way I was wired, right? I, I'm, I'm sensitive. And I know a lot of you are sensitive too. So when we make sensitivity a problem, then we learn to adapt ourselves and to, you know, twist in ourselves and pretzel ourselves so that other people can be comfortable around us. Oh, but that's exhausting, isn't it? Yes. So, um, so Goldilocks really is about getting clear about what works for you. And when we're operating more in a way that honors what works for us, it allows us to shine. It allows us to give more freely and to be more effective and even more efficient. You know, we're operating on all cylinders instead of having to just cut this part off. We can actually come together and move forward in some pretty wonderful ways, but if we're backing our energy up because we're afraid we're going to be too much for someone or someone else isn't going to like it that we want it a certain way, then, um, you know, we're, we're shortchanging ourselves and we're shortchanging the world. And right now the world really needs people who are on their sweet spot, who are operating from their center, who can be more effective and, um, who are more, able to envision a road forward because we really don't have that right now. Things are, we're in a big breakdown place right now. The world is detoxing and it's profound and disturbing. Um, and some of us have known this was coming for a long time. Um, but there's going to be a day after this when we can start putting things in place again and putting things in order. And in the meantime, the more we can get aligned with who we really are and what we really have to offer, the better. Because there's going to be a groundswell of people who are helping to move um, humanity and society forward. Um, and those people are going to operate best if they're operating true to, the, true, true to themselves. Because these big monstrosities of corporations and... Um, you know, a lot of that's in government and who knows what else. Anyway, a lot of that stuff is going to be irrelevant going, going forward. But, you know, we're still, we need to operate from our hearts. You know, that's the most efficient thing you can do. And to start learning to, to pay attention to who, who's talking to me right now. And how, how, what do I want? You know, if we can be alive in the moment, the goddess of now talks a lot about if we can be on um, target with ourselves, if we can pay attention to what's going on in the moment, then we know the next step to take. And the more true we are, it true as in, in terms of lined up and in alignment with our own body, mind, spirit, that we are, the more effective that we can be. If we're a little over here and a little over here and a little that way, um, it's really hard to get anything done. You know, we're just kind of jerking and herking. Um, and what we want to do is we want to be clear. This is me. This is what I'm here for. This is what I can do really well. This is what I have to offer. Um, and I feel like that's what we're heading into. And um, we're on our way. And some of us really need to get busy with that now, you know, and, and honor uh, and honor and give you know, be that sort of solid, trustworthy point of reference for others. Um, you know, we've waited a long time to get to this point where we could actually stand up and, and say, you know, here I am. This is what I'm here for. This is, this is why I came because of this, this 
catastrophe that's going on right now is uh, I want to say it's almost over. Things can get better from here. Um, and they will get better as we get better. And as we bring our energy back into ourselves again and stop being so um, afflicted and so um, beside ourselves. <laughs>